Hello friends and welcome to this magic tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to create the green screen effect. So we use a green screen which can be anything really, a wall behind you that is green or a cloth. So you can uh, add a background video or an image to that uh, screen, right? It's uh, the cheapest way to create a, a background and uh, if you just look it up uh, online on YouTube you can find a lot of uh, Hollywood uh, behind the scenes movies where, where they show you how they create uh, amazing backgrounds just using green screen so a lot of the Hollywood movies are shot in a, in a studio with green screen and the whole background is then reconstructed from footage that was shot some other times. Now we use green screen because it's um, the green is uh, basically the color that is most different from the human uh, the human uh, flesh, the human skin. But of course we can also use blue and get the same effect. So let's just uh, go into magics and see how we can do this. Alright, now we are in Magic Edit Pro Plus. So let me just deconstruct what I have done here. Let me just zoom out on the track. Alright, let's go to the first piece of the footage. So yeah, this is the first piece of the footage where no effect is applied. So as we scroll further, this is where the effect uh, has been applied, but there is no background to, to be shown on the green uh, t-shirt. And this is the part where the, we have both the effect and uh, the background footage. So, in Magix you know that the first uh, track is the baseline and all the other tracks overlay onto the first track. So now, since the green is made to be transparent in some way, that's basically what the, the chroma key does. Uh, we need to overlay this footage onto another footage, which is this one, because uh, we need to have a background. So always when you edit with green screen in Magix, you have to leave the first, uh, the first track empty to add the background. Now, this piece of footage is uh, something that has been cropped. Let me show you how I did that. I went to section. So this is the original and then with size and position I moved it so you can place it anywhere you want. Let's undo this, I'll leave it as it were. Okay, so now let's go to the first piece of footage where no effect is applied. You simply select the footage and you go to effects, video effects, chroma key and you click on the green colors to be hidden, green. So now I have this uh, effect applied. The t-shirt is black. You can also play with this uh, with the threshold and the fading range. Let's play a bit so see what happens here. And with the threshold as well. And now let's just bring some footage here to be shown in the green area. So yeah, this is it. This is how you go from regular to green screen. And of course you can use blue and water and uh, black or white. You can use any of these color to, to set as a transparent color and then you can add a background to that color. Now if, if we go over here, where I change my t-shirt, this again is uh, where no effect is applied and then from this point forward, from this cut over here again you can see the effect in action. So the blue is, uh, is made to be transparent. Now again we can play with the, with the threshold and the fading range. So like this and if I pull too much on the fading range you can see the software find some blue areas uh, in other parts of the shots as well as as you can see here on the on the door so that's not very good that's not what I want you can pull back the same with the uh, threshold 
you can uh, fade the effect basically. So yeah, this is it. This is how you get the green screen effect in Magic's Edit Pro Plus. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. Cheers.